Morning guys, it's about, what time is it, 10.30, 10.38, um, heading back to work, I had to run by the house, and I forgot to grab the camera, so I wanted to grab that for you guys and get a vlog out for you guys today again, I did the one on Saturday, I'm trying to upload that now, it failed the other day, so, grab my camera bag, um, but, Excuse me. Want to throw a vlog up for you guys um, today, just because I have some uh, free time going on in the schedule. Uh, right now, I've got tires going on my other set of wheels for this, getting stuff ready for GIE. So yeah, let's go. Go ahead and uh, get on to work. So hope you guys enjoy the video. Alright guys, so just got this one knocked out here. Uh, this one, the front of this one is a weekly, the back is a bi-weekly. Uh, I did the backyard last week, so... Um, did the backyard last week. Uh, probably the backyard hadn't grown enough to justify being caught this week, because I'm... For next week, with what I'm doing schedule-wise is... Um, I'm gonna push everything back an extra week and I'm gonna try and get uh, as much of the remaining aerations I can done on Friday and Monday and then head to GIE on Tuesday. Um, so that's kind of the plan because I was gonna cut next week's schedule Friday, Saturday, Monday, Tuesday and leave late Tuesday night or early Wednesday morning. But um, every, we're, we're actually in a moderate drought right now, so this is the first little bit of rain we've had in a month or more. Um, and it's not much. It's definitely not gonna soften the ground up any. We need a good two day soaking rain to do something like that. But uh, I just gotta tell people, put some water on their lawns before I come and aerate them so I'll actually get some decent plugs out of the ground, which even then, on, with the stand on and rock solid ground, I mean, I'm still getting an inch and a half, two inch plugs, which isn't terrible, but again, they could always be deeper, but what any little bit helps, I guess, um, but just kind of tell them to water them. So that's the plan sort of for the rest of the week since I cut Monday through Thursday. I'm gonna get everything in this week that I can, as long as people don't tell me to skip and go from there so uh heading to the next one now it's here around the corner uh from the last one i just did uh maybe i'll throw the gopro on something and get some filming into this one uh, i think i skipped this one last week so this one's also a weekly uh i've got my some of my weeklies are really weird i've got a lot that are mostly weeds but they still want them cut every week just to keep it down I guess because they don't like them super tall and a lot of times they're getting cut on two and a half or three just to keep them from growing like crazy so this is the one I skipped it last week it's not super tall obviously the camera's not gonna be able to show you all that well with it but um yeah, let's, uh, let's get this one cut and keep on rolling. What's going on guys? So I never actually did get to finish the vlog yesterday, so I think I'm just gonna include what I got in today's video and I might end up throwing a little bit of that mowing in here, but I think I'm gonna actually upload that mowing separate as just a mowing video. But um, kind of to recap yesterday, I did get the new tires put on. Um, so those are ready to go, the truck is got tires on it now ready to go for the expo um, here at one of the Wednesday ones that's what time is it about 1 15 I think I've got four left to do today I've already done six or seven so um, figured I'd get a little bit of mowing thrown in with today's vlog and um, yeah so uh, I'll go set up the camera and I mowed the front the back is wide open back there um, I need to actually trim some of those hollies up. Uh, she's got to check with her landlord, but, uh, but yeah, so uh, let's get this mowing done and uh, keep on rolling. <laughs>
right guys so quick before the camera dies I've got another battery in the truck so I can finish the video but uh this is a bi-weekly I picked up a while ago um, I had done there was a bunch of uh, overgrown bushes out here across the front uh, where all the mulch beds are I ripped all those out if I've got a picture I'll throw it up on the screen I believe I do but I uh, did those Rip the bushes out, put these knockout roses in, um, and I can't remember for the life of me what this is. I need to bring some Roundup and spray uh, the beds out, and it'll probably get mulched again in the spring more than likely. Left that there. I need to trim that, actually. I had trimmed that when I had done the landscaping, but, um, but yeah, so this is a newer, newer one to me, um, and yeah, so... Got that landscaping done um, back in the spring, and then the landlord's supposed to take out this dead tree here. And I'm a, I talked to her to get him them to talk to him about trimming those hollies. Y'all saw me; I had to duck over because they're just in the way. So, uh, but yeah, so uh, we'll uh, go ahead and get this one line trimmed, blown off, and uh, head to the next one. The next one's an apartment complex. So I doubt I'm going to film there just for because of the amount of people that are there but uh yeah so i'll see you guys next uh next stop or next clip so what's up guys it is now thursday um i think i'm just gonna do a weekly video and kind of maybe try and make this a regular thing um maybe do a, a weekly vlog and then a bonus video but uh here at the first one it is thursday uh this is my last full day of mowing before the expo um I don't know, quite know how much I've got to do today on schedule, but uh, it's like 58 degrees right now and I'm out here in a short sleeve shirt and it feels fantastic. It was in the 90s this time last week, so it's a big jump. Um, last day of mowing, got some aeration to do tomorrow and Monday, um, and then it's expo time, so we got one, two, three, one, maybe two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We got ten, nine to eleven to do today, uh, depending on time. I've got the last one of the day is like four acres, so I might end up cutting that in the morning tomorrow. Um, but for the most part, this is the last full day. Um, and then I got a clean up and some aeration to do tomorrow, and then aerations on Friday. So let's uh, let's get going for the day. And uh, yeah, get these yards done. Um, thankfully, the weather has been a little more cooperative this year than it was last year, and I can actually skip everything next week and push it back an extra week. So, gonna get these bad boys unloaded. Uh, this one I normally cut with the skag, so I'll get some, uh, get a little bit of filming in on this one.
so it is now Friday uh, before GIE and um, heading to get some aeration done got the stand on and the stinger loaded on the trailer I got to pick up some more seed uh, the whitewash is really freaking bad let me see if I can adjust this a little bit probably not much um, but um, I'm just trying to adjust the ISO on it a little bit just to get the sun kind of the glare out of the way but uh got the two aerators loaded got my uh i don't know if i'm gonna get it there it is screaming eights fertilizer uh, i've got like seven bags of that just it, i haven't used it as fast as the seed two bags of transition i gotta go pick up some more i might switch back to the seed i was using last year they hadn't had it earlier on in the year so um got five or six to do between today and monday and um so yeah let's uh we're all loaded up i got the lesco spreader back here too uh this is not the roto drop one that's got that drop spreader i honestly honestly i haven't even used that this year um i bought it because i liked the concept and figured i would use it more but um i just i just haven't honestly to be completely honest it I don't know. I, I wish I'd have rather bought one of these over the Roto Drop one, but uh, I mean, it's nice. It's functional for what it is, but a lot of the areas that I use that Roto Drop, I'll just take the bucket right there that you can't really see because of the sunlight and just hand seed. Um, I mean, and it just it uses so much seed too as another thing. So, uh, but yeah, so. Uh, Let's go head to site one and pick up some more seed and get rolling. So I've already done a cleanup. I actually still have the Z Master back here. I did that this morning. It was the first leaf cleanup for the year. So uh, it's about that time. Um, so still probably got two more weeks of mowing after GIE. Maybe not every customer. Some of them might be done for the year, but I'd like to hit a lot of them uh, still. So uh, actually I need to grab a blower. Um, and then we'll get going. All right, guys, so I just left Best Buy, um, picked up a couple things. Uh, this is really dark. I have a neutral density lens filter on my camera. There we go, that's a lot better. Um, just picked up a couple things from Best Buy. I got a new lens for this. It's a wide angle lens, which is something I've been looking at for a little while and they um, got a couple SD cards. I needed a new SD card for the GoPro and I needed, so I needed accessories for a certain percentage off so I also grabbed um, an SD card for this. I've got two 32 gig cards. I just grabbed a 128 so that should cover me pretty well for the Expo um, and kind of keep, keep a good bit of storage on the camera for the whole for the whole week, ideally. Um, I probably shouldn't go out this way. There's no stoplight and it's a pain to get out of this intersection. Um, but, and I got some, uh, I got a little camera cleaning pen and a, uh, finally got a windscreen for my microphone. That's just one of the basic Rode video mic go, uh, the non-powered, the non-powered, uh, microphone so uh, yeah um, maybe I'll test that lens out heading to the last two for the day it's five o'clock now um, I don't know if I'm gonna make this turn with this car here but um, so yeah let's uh, head out and get those two knocked out and call it a day cuz I am exhausted. I picked up seed and fertilizer for uh, the rest of what I've got going on um, today and Monday. So Monday is going to be a full day aeration and then we head out of town 6 a.m. Tuesday. Uh, meeting a buddy of mine about a half hour away from me or so. So yeah, I'm going to head on in the next one and I'll get some filming in when we get to the new one. Oh, and I picked up a camera bag too because I needed a bigger bag um, for everything to fit in because my camera bag's a little small. So uh, 
yeah, get going to the next one, and hopefully I'll catch some film in there. So, see you guys there. All right, guys. So we're here. Got these two to do. The one directly behind me. Um, that one, and the one I'm working on now. So I'm gonna set the camera up and get going. Um, this is still the standard lens on the camera. Uh, I'm not gonna swap them over. It's still in its packaging. There's no sense in me opening it right now. So I'll get this guy set up and uh, let's get these aerations done. This one, the first one here, I'm seeding. Uh, the other one is I'm not. So the guy's gonna do his. But set this up and get some aeration footage. So let's get it. So, this one's knocked out. Gonna get the uh, neighbors done. This one's getting seated, like I said. I'm gonna reset the camera over here. We'll knock his out. And uh, yeah, that thing is freaking awesome. So, um, y'all actually saw both of these get done last year's video uh, before GIA. Not doing anything with the ditch side. You got the culvert there. They said not to worry about it so uh yeah so uh set this thing up somewhere and uh we'll get uh we'll get this one knocked out Alright guys, so these two are done. This one was actually really saturated, which was really good. Uh, we're actually in a drought right now. Uh, let's see here if I can get... I mean, I was getting some good 2-3 inch plugs out of this one, which is awesome. It's actually really soft to walk on right now. Um, and it did... 
I had that one running at 400. I had to move this one down to 250. I tore up an area over there, um, but I raked it back in. But I uh, got some really good plugs out of this one. Again, not seeding this one. Just throwing seed down at the neighbors in the front. I'm gonna throw a full bag of seed and then whatever fertilizer. I'm not gonna over fertilize it, but I'm gonna put a decent amount of seed down. You can see here, this is where it kind of tore up right through here. So not a big deal. Again, it's aerating, it's tearing the ground up anyway. Not a huge deal, but uh, go ahead, get this seed thrown down. It is 612. I'm ready to go home. I've had a headache all afternoon, so I'm ready to go take the trailer back to the shop and head on to the house. So, uh, yeah, gonna get the seed thrown down here and uh, head on out. guys so these two are done um, heading back to the shop now um, we're looking at rain on Sunday I mean at least pull the aerators off um, I might take the seed and the tarp I've got kind of put it in a square and cover I don't know why this thing isn't is it auto is it on autofocus I think it is there we go that's a lot better um, so I think what I'm gonna do is probably just tarp the stuff um, in the, that's in the trailer. Let's see if I can set this in the cup holder. There we go. Um, so I think what I'm gonna do is tarp the stuff on the trailer, because I'm not gonna air, well, I don't know, it's not much to unload into the, into the shop. I can just kind of set it off to the side if I had to, but, um, so yeah, heading back there now, gonna at least get the aerators pulled off. I, I might unload the seed and stuff, I don't know yet. Um, Cause I really don't want it to get taken. We are kind of in a central area. Um, but again, I kind of feel like it might also be okay. So we'll see, but uh, I'll figure that out when I get there. But uh, yeah, so heading back to the shop now. See you guys there. What's up guys? So it's now 9.43. Um, just got the trailer unloaded, kind of standing in the light to get what video I can. Uh, don't see myself doing much tomorrow, other than maybe some little stuff around here at the shop. So I'm going to go ahead and end this video, and hope you enjoyed the video, um, kind of of the week. Uh, I know I didn't film too much during the days, um, but... I figured I'd just do throw a week video together um, and then hopefully I'll get some filming Monday because I think all I'm going to be doing Monday is um, I got one to dethatch so I've got actually ordered a Jericho aerator, or, uh, not aerator, dethatcher for the V-Ride and I've got a new bagger for that, i got an accelerator for that so excited to put, I've uh, been using the bagger, excited to put the uh, Thatcher to the test. I've uh, got one of those to do and then a bunch of aerations on Monday, so and Tuesday we head out of town. So uh yeah, so uh hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you go rate, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one.